There are multiple ways to pull up patient information in Axiom. As you can see when you log in, you've got your left navigation menu, and then you've got your right desktop area where you can view the information. First thing I'm going to do is go into the Rolodex. As you can see, I've got a drop down menu here. So I could pull up a patient card or contact notes. But for now, I'm just going to hit the Rolodex option and I get my search criteria window. Here I can put in a name and then select the name column and that would pull up a list of names. Chart number, I type in a chart number and then select the chart number column. Birth date, hit the birth date column, that sort of thing. First thing I'm going to do though is I'm just going to use a name for now because I know I'm going to use a test subject. So if I type in DCG and select name, you see that I get a list of results. Now of course I just pulled up a lot of type of dots. But uh, because there are so many, I get an option, just a search criteria option, because it just means that there are lots and lots of type of dots. So we're going to say, no, we don't really need to continue, because I see what I want right here. I've got DCG anyone. When I select this patient, notice that the information for this patient comes up at the top. Also, at the bottom in the status bar, I now get information about this patient. So I've got my provider information I've got alerts on the patient you see the patient name which is anyone DCG chart number and then just miscellaneous messaging icons here if I want to return to this patient over and over again I don't want to have to do the search over and over again so what I'm going to do is double click this person and have them come up in my scratch pad then I can hit the check mark next to this person now whenever I log into Axiom this patient will always be in this little search area here or this little scratch pad here so I can easily find them. Now having selected this patient I can go into the EHR and pull up their information or really any of the Axiom modules to pull up information. I can also see more information if I want to. For instance starting um, here with the patient card on the right if I select the patient card, I get information, um, a full record of this patient. So I've got their uh, work information, their address and phone numbers, their insurance information would normally appear here, um, their physician and contact information or emergency contact information, chart information, pictures, and then down here we see a list of all of their appointments or I could pull up information, I can click on any of these boxes and find information. So if I wanted to pull up more about the insurance information, I can do that. Okay. Additionally, uh, aside from the patient um, card where I can see these patient appointments listed, if I just wanted to look at the patient appointments, I could do that as well by selecting the patient appointments. And you can see that I've got information about the patient, family members, more information about chart numbers, uh, contact information, and then I would have a list of all of these appointments listed here. All right, so another way that I can come in and look for a patient is to go straight into scheduler. So I've got a drop down here where I can see my scheduler module, with active and weekly options. I select option, I can come in and see there's my DCG um, patient that I've been working with. I can right click on this patient and pull up their patient card or I can even select the patient and you see that now this patient is selected because they are appearing in my status bar. So an additional way that I can find patient information is I can go into my personal planner and this way I can find different types of information um, for different providers um, as well as different patients. So if I'm faculty test and I have assigned patients, I can select the assigned patients tab and hit the search option and normally I would get a list of patients here that would come up. I can also pull up a list of patients for any provider by coming up here and changing that. Uh, so I'm going to look up maybe one of my students. VA5. I'm just going to put in the provider number. If I wanted to, I could also do the search here and find that information just as easily. Or 
all the patients come up for this for this student and select the patient and now that patient is going to show up in my status bar so those are three really easy ways to access a patient or patient information through Axiom.